So Gregory, you're wondering like, when is the right time to decide to outsource or to delegate? Like, for example, you're saying, well, gosh, you know, with Facebook, Instagram ads, great idea, but do I need to actually learn all the details of that stuff or just have someone else do it? And um, I, my framework around this is uh, I call it EADA, E-A-D-A, eliminate, automate, delegate, appreciate, uh, which basically, um, you know, you can uh, look into that. I have a blog post on it, but basically what you can't, eliminate okay looking at everything you do is like can i possibly eliminate you, you should we should eliminate as much as possible and uh rishab here on the call would very much appreciate that right like less less but better like we should eliminate as much of what we do as possible like of course because then we have more energy in our life for um for useful and more impactful things purposeful things so can't eliminate something because you find it that important can you automate it and when it comes to facebook instagram ads you you automate it to some degree, but you have to set up the automation, right? So question is, if you can't automate it or you don't know how to automate it, do you then delegate it? Yeah, now delegating it means that you need to have enough of the budget to delegate and you need to have a trustworthy person to delegate it to. So that's, that's, what, that's the hard part. It's like, well, how much am I supposed to be paying for this kind of thing? And how do I know I can trust that person to do a good job on it? Which means you either, that person comes from a trusted recommendation, that's the easiest way to get there, or you have to know the stuff enough to be able to monitor them to know that they're actually doing the right job, which is not easy. Even if someone comes from a trusted source, ideally you still know enough about the task to say, yeah, you know, I feel like they're, they're, they're getting on to the right thing or they're not doing the right thing because they're, what they're doing might not be aligned with their strategy. So. If you, can't autom if you can't automate it or delegate it, then one thing left to do, you have to appreciate it. You have to do it yourself. You have to appreciate the value of doing it yourself. Like why, like why am I the one to do my, keynote, my own keynote speeches and not someone else? <laughs> I shouldn't be delegating it, that stuff. I'm the front man for my keynote speeches, so I should be doing it myself. I should appreciate that. Or, uh, you know, um, anyway, so... Um, so when it comes to, for example, the example of the Facebook ad stuff, yeah, I mean, there's so many, I mean, that's, that's a really good example because there's so many people who would love to take that, to take that task from you. And we can talk offline about who might, who I might recommend for that. So, um, so yes, I would say, uh, if you have the budget to do it, we could talk about that too. Um, yes. So great. Thank you. That was very helpful. You're welcome.